This morning in the Eagle Studio, Kathy Bicker with us. Kathy, welcome here. Thank you. It's great to be here. We're excited for summer. We see the sun is shining today. The warmer weather is coming and you're looking forward to summer. Yes, I am very much like many others. There we go. And we're excited for uh, the Harvest Festival. It was announced that it's, it's happening. When is Harvest Festival? Taking place August 12th through 14th. August 12th through 14th. And there's a lot of things uh, that I'm sure you guys are working on every single day. This is a, a process that continues for some time. Yes, it definitely is. We started a couple months back and there's still lots to do. There's still lots to do, but there are some things uh, that Kathy has told us about today about the Harvest Festival, things that we can expect. And one of those is, of course, the Midway. Yeah, Midway's coming back. We're very excited to have Wonder Shows back with us this year. Absolutely. And then uh, with that comes a couple of other things. I know you guys uh, have a big focus on entertainment. And while a lot of the headliners aren't confirmed yet, or you guys just are, are, are keeping that, you know, lips sealed on that, there are some uh, children entertainment. There's going to be the headliners. All that stuff is happening. Yes, that is the plan. We're hoping to have a full-on festival like previous years. There we go, a full-on festival. That's exciting news. And even uh, you've mentioned that one of my favorite things is the parade, and even the parade is going on with a couple of new things. Yeah, the parade's uh, in the works. We have plans for that. We're not certain if there might be a route change this year or if lineup might be a little bit different than we're used to seeing. But we're working on a new float for the Harvest Festival float. So that's very exciting. That is exciting stuff. We cannot wait to go and see it. Uh, we're just so pumped about the Harvest Festival. When you talk to people about Harvest Festival and getting things together, what kind of things are you hearing? Are, are people pumped? People are excited about Fawn and Cub coming. They love the additional shopping opportunities, especially if their children are entertained by the children entertainers while they go do that. So that works out really well. And they're really looking forward to headliners. Absolutely. And mm-hmm. so those are still, we got to wait for the newsletter. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. And so uh, with the Winkler Harvest Festival, of course, you've been to uh, a few in your time here in Winkler. Can you talk about uh, what the Harvest Festival means to you? Why do people get so excited about this? It's just the whole atmosphere. I mean, the smell of the mini donuts as you walk through, the heading over to the Midway, um, the great shows that get put on at the main stage. It, The whole environment, it just, it's exhilarating. It is exhilarating. We cannot wait to uh, see what's going on. If somebody wants to get involved or want to know more about the Harvest Festival, is there a place they can do that? Yeah, check out our website. There we go. Awesome. And so uh, one other thing I wanted to ask you about was volunteers. Of course, volunteers are a big part of the Winkler Harvest Festival. Do people go there too if they want to be a, be a volunteer and help out? Anybody looking to get involved with the festival or find out more information can go to winklerharvestfestival.com. We have a newsletter out this year. So you can sign up for that. You can get new information as it's coming out before it's even posted online. There we go. Well, Kathy, thanks so much for coming in this morning and hyping us up about the Harvest Festival. It's great to be here.